everyone keeps telling me how my story is supposed to go. Look in my eyes, tell me your tell. Do you see the road? I match my soul. Tell me the size whenever the smoke clear out of my face and my picture perfect. Nah, I'm gonna do my own thing. Look in my eyes, tell me your tell. Do you see the road? I match my soul. Tell me the size whenever the Are you ready to be entertained? Let's get into another reaction of Chuma Season 2, Episode 9. This title is called I Will Rise Up. Let's jump right into it. You want to see this in full reaction? The links are down below. And while you're down there, don't forget to hit the like button, share, and don't forget to comment. Now, without further ado, let's jump into True Blood and find out exactly what the show has got to give. I got nothing to say to you. What the hell you just go? Oh, she's gonna blow shit up. If I could have your attention, please. Oh, no. You may be immortal, Lorena, but you are dead to me. Oops. I wish you hadn't said that. Oh, she's gone. Message for you all from Reverend Steve Newman. <laughs> Sookie! Oh, Bill? I covered her. Eric! Get the humans. <sighs> you think you'd really do it too late? <laughs> Why did they turn it down? Nope. You ain't done! <laughs> Jason! Uh. Silver. How could get caught her? No time. Suck it out. Look it out. It's too gross. Oh, son of a mother. Ah. Got it. Another one. Oh, he lied. Tell the cowards who lead you. The cowards who sent children to do their killing. Little vampires showed mercy where they had none. Luke. Blown to smithereens. Who's dead? Stan, Paolo, Catherine. Sucked silver out of Eric's chest and saved his life, even though I really didn't want to. She was superb. He was already healing. The bullets would have pushed themselves out. Or she to drink his blood. No! Sense your emotions. You big lying a-hole! Bill, you're right. I believe I can sense your emotions. I'll never do anything for you again. Monster! Go to the hotel, Camilla. They've been alerted. Security is in place. Wow. What you gonna do, Godric? Eric is hysterical. I could kick myself. I'm so stupid. At least we both came out alive. I know better than to believe one word out of that man's mouth. Eric has had a thousand years practice in deceit. Count it on your goodness. There's no shame in that. He'll always know where I am and how I feel. You feel some attraction to him. Sexual. Oops! When I get that feeling, I want sexual healing, sexual healing. I had to stop it clearly to do that. <laughs> it's another consequence of the blood. I was determined to form this bond with you. I could kill him. I concur. Or maybe there's an operation and I can't be the only vampire virgin. We can do everything when we figure out how. You should break up with me. Hang the girl's back. It's just a thing. What is this I thing? Per I don't ever want to hear you talk about breaking up. In fact, you mean so much to me. I want you to meet my mama. Oh! Oh, nobody ever wants me to meet anybody. Oh, don't get no. too excited. Look, she hates vampires. Well, I don't care what she does. You're introducing me to your family. I never even hoped for that. Oh! The sun's coming up. I'm going with you. <laughs> no. You should be a vampire. But uh, for now, I'll just sit right here until you fall asleep. You are the sweetest boy in the world. I love Hoyt. I'll sing to you, so you know, you know I'm right here. You don't have to sing Hoyt. My sweet vampire. Oh, my goodness. How much did you drink this time? It's embarrassing is what it is. I will never understand that. I'd be ashamed of letting go. Because I've never been this out of control. But oh. there's got to be some kind of control or things will be chaos. Sounds good. I don't want to be blacking out. Is that what you think it is? We're all bashed up. There's nothing higher about that except for we must have been high. I'm a blackout expert. Are you? Certified. Ah. What about the saints of India? They would blackout. 
run and dance through the streets. Everybody thought they were crazy. They were crazy. No, Tara. They were ecstatic. All that fake civilization bullshit just fell away so they could dissolve into the infinite. Oh. <laughs> a few bumps and bruises. It's a small price to pay for bliss. Bloody Mary, anyone? Oh, no, bud, cut us loose. All I did was lose my pants. There's no law against that. I got no evidence, bud. You got no right to keep me locked up. I just hate the way she walks. I can't Listen. sleep. Join the club. You were a star in Bon Ton. I was the throwaway. Well, they like my athletics, my sex abilities, but they don't like me for me. Even Sarah, well, they acted like they did before they tried to kill me. They stopped my mind from going round and round thinking about... Soldiers of the Sun? Didn't you for one second think what Gran would say? Don't talk about Gran. I won't talk about her. I can't. Because I don't want to feel anything. Can't stop remembering her or loving her because it hurts too much. We'll keep her alive in our hearts and our prayers. And that's the way it's gonna be. Our whole family's gone, so everybody who counts. We're all alone. We gotta grow up. We gotta stick together. And we gotta be good to each other. Or we're letting them down. I'm sorry about uh, everything. I'm a dumbass. You used your brain instead of just letting it take up space in your skull. I'm sorry, too. I always love you, Jason. Even when I want to stick your head in a bucket. And I love you, even though I wish you'd cook for me more. We're born the way we are. Oh, <laughs> she's such a weird person. That was touching about the grandmother. Me too. We're on the tube you already. You kidnapped a prominent member of our community. He volunteered. Did he? You used your tax-exempt religious institution as an anti-vampire terrorist enclave. You attacked us. You murdered my father. That's an allegation. This is a fact. Fighting for God's green earth and daytime and Christmas mm -hmm. and Easter eggs. Human rights. Did I finish my thoughts? What? You're done. <gasps> If he's not the center of attention, he just flips out. There's a witch and a son bitch. Ah Fuck you, Nolans. Now can we see the freezer? Why? Where they found that woman or one sick buzzard. You are. Go find some roadkill, because you ain't eating here. What do you want? A knife or fork and a spoon if that's not too much trouble. Here in the back. Go get him yourself. Oh, come on. Kobe will eat cat food if you put mayo on it. Mama's got to work. Daphne? Oh, my God. She was clumsy, stupid, and mean, but I wouldn't wish that kind of death on a possum. Plus, that poor soul out in the parking lot. Yeah, look out for you if you look out for me. Right. When's it gonna stop? Please quit being so much more peculiar than you usually are. I didn't mean to be peculiar at you. I just don't know what we did. We had sex. You can't remember? Don't take this the wrong way, but... Nope, I can't remember the last time I had sex with anybody. Oh. Give me some sugar. Wow, shit, this is good. I know, I'm late. Yeah. Go ahead, order lunch on me. Stop. What the fuck is this? He didn't do it to me. I don't know what happened, but it wasn't him. Well, I'm gonna show you how I feel to get your ass beat. I'm gonna take those eyelashes out your eyes. Lafayette, yeah, stop! He poisoned. He ain't never gonna change, and he may wind up killing you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Oh. Fuck you. Please do Let's something. Let's go. And don't What the fuck is y'all looking at, you ugly ass necks? Huh? Oh, it would never have run off to Dallas without a word with murders all over the place. Go ahead, speak your mind. See what I mean? All of a sudden, you're a different person. What do you think your daddy would say? The only time that you ever mention him is when you're trying to make me do something that I don't want to do. And what are you doing with vampires anyway? They are wrong, wrong, wrong. Why do you have so much hate in you? My mama, who hates Methodists. I got my reason. African American. Hush. That's a secret. People who don't take care of their gardens are cats and dogs and bait every girl that i ever liked check to a girlfriend who will kill you and eat you i think that's reasonable you don't even know her jessica may be a vampire but she's the one for me <laughs> you don't have any say over that i'll let you run me around because i didn't want to hurt your feelings those days are over if you can't be nice then i will leave this house and never come back You're my baby boy i'm not a baby i'm a grown-ass man eric finish your sentence what was I saying? You're telling me why you'd be a terrible vampire and I was disagreeing. I'd rather be alive than undead. And then y'all are always killing. Now you'd adapt, like we all do. 
Trade the sun for moon and star. But me, I want them all. <laughs> oh, greedy. The right temperament for a vampire. What? I'm high maintenance, bloodthirsty. Everybody thinks you're a darling, don't they? I am a darling. You do anything for them? <laughs> your brother, your friends. Where's Bill? You've already abandoned him. I have not. I love Bill. I used to think you had no sense of humor. I used to think you were made of cold, hard stone. You're deep. You feel. Only for Sookie. Only for Sookie? You don't want Bill. He means nothing to you. This is the beginning. <laughs> wow. There she is. She come to get us out. <laughs> there she is. Hey. Hello. Jeff Dearborn? Is that Mary Ann? Mary Ann! Hey, party's back here! Oh, hey, oh, it's in here! Oh, it'll be a fly. Just coffee if you want. Seems every person in Bon Tomp's getting arrested, but they don't know what they've done. Major crime wave. Misdemeanors. Crazy things I never saw in over 40 years. Let me help. I'll talk them down. It's my best thing. I heard Sam Lott is here. I couldn't believe it. A fine, upstanding business. But I'll show you where he's at. I, I, I know the way. Sit. <sighs> I want Sam or Lot. He's right there. Now I am really irritated. Never thought you'd be so pretty, Miss Fortenberry. And I can't tell you how grateful I am that you came. Sure, you tried this on or that on. And, you know, is it the black shoes or the red shoes? Or Hoyt is a very, very, very good boy. Mm. I surely wish I could meet your people. See what your family's like. Mama. Somebody made me a vampire against my will, Miss Fortenberry. I don't have a family anymore. That wasn't fair. But Hoyt has a bright future ahead of him. Wander around all hours of the night for the rest of his life with an orphan vampire. I can give him everything that a human could. Not hardly. Like what? Babies. You'll thank me one day. Not today. When are you coming home? Never. I'm gonna need another one of these. You can't do that. That's against the rules. Come on. Hey, we play by my rules. That means no rules. Huh, well, looky here. Aliens. Ms. Thornton, welcome. Join us. No, we good. You're taking my daughter away from you. Ridiculous. Take a load off. We're in the middle of a game. Yeah, strip poker. What's your drink? Vodka, whiskey, hairspray, antifreeze. I'm sweating. Icy cold, thick, pours like oil. I don't know what you is, but I'm feeling you. And you's a soulless bitch. Never take nothing from you except my girl. Tara, let's go. Fuck off. She's my girlfriend. Won't you talk to me? Tara, get up. I ain't playing. Let's go. She ain't going nowhere. Please, oh, I'm not? begging you. Well, it will be the first fucking time. Uh-uh. What you do to her? Go on, Bible, let me now. Let me now. Oh, let's go back. Go on, Tara. Let's go back. Your father. Don't go. Go on, run, you guys. She'll come back. She'll bring them with her. Come on. Do you have any fucking idea of the PR mess you've made? I should drain every one of you bastards. Stan went after the church on his own. Knew that he had a kink about slaughtering humans, but you, his nestmates, his sheriff, had no clue. Don't talk to him that way. Don't talk to me that way. Is she stronger than Godric? This lady, because she seems like it. How'd they manage to abduct you? They would have taken one of us sooner or later. I offered myself. They wanted you to meet the son and you were willing? And then I hear about a traitor? Irrelevant. Only a rumor. This is a national vampire disaster. And nobody at the top has any sympathy for any of you. Sheriff, you fucked up. You're fired. I agree. You want to lose your area, Viking? Oh, you don't have that kind of power. Hey, I'm on TV. Try me. I remove myself from all positions of authority. Works for me. Godric rescued me from a really large rapist. That's nice. No, Moving listen. Moving on. Ah! And then it could have been a hundred, a million times worse. You should thank him. Attracting a suicide bomber? For piss poor judgment? I think not. <clears throat> Tell me about the bombing, please. Every single detail. A boy walked in the lair. I thought he was someone's human companion. He's running wild now. He's headed straight from hell. The god who comes demands his sacrifice. Where is Samurlot? 
He ain't been here all day. Bring him to me! Look here, look here. Watch it. Grab him. Oh, oh, he almost got your mic. I heard you were here. Godric, come to my suite and fill out the forms. Soon. First, I have something to say. I apologize for all the harm I've caused. For all our lost ones. Human and vampire. I will make amends. I swear. Take it easy. It's just a few signatures. Look in my heart. You have to listen to me. There's nothing to say. There is. God is gonna die? We have a score to settle. <clears throat> Bill, why would you do this? I'm part of her now. I understand why. Bill and Suki are both, you know, those characters. She looks like she's about to go to a picnic and have some sausages. <laughs> Godric is not your concern. If it weren't for him, I wouldn't be standing here. You of all people should understand how he feels. What if in 1800 years you were Godric? And I'm coming with you. Unfortunately. I wish you could, but it'll be dawn in a little while. With Godric there, you don't have to worry about me. Suki, in all honesty, what can you do for him? I just gotta be there. Bill was like, I want to be annoying in this episode, so here, hold my torch. It's insanity. Our existence is insanity. We don't belong here. But we are here! It's not right. I will keep you alive by force. Why would you be so cruel? Go to Kjordan. We are half the old hundred and of Shalik. I hate that. But sometimes the close caption for them works. Father. Brother. Son. Father, brother, <laughs> son. I won't let you die alone. Yes, you will. Yes, yes. you'll make her. I command you. I'll stay with him. As long as it takes. You can't you just walk normal? And why did you wear that picnic dress? It won't take long. You know, it wasn't very smart. The Fellowship of the Sun part? I thought it might fix everything somehow. Do you believe in God? Yes. How will he punish me? God doesn't punish. God forgives. You'll care for him? Eric. You know how he is. I can take the blame for that, too. Maybe not. Are you very afraid? No, I'm full of joy. But the pain, I'm afraid for you. A human with me at the end. In a thousand years. And I can still be surprised. In this, I see God. So that was kind of sad, y'all. Not gonna lie, I actually really wanted Godric. I wanted to see more Godric. I thought that like this character was like the way everybody kept talking about Godric before I even got to Godric. I thought like he was going to give me a little bit more. His story was actually a very strong story, um, and it goes really more in depth with Eric and Eric the Vampire and us connecting with Eric more than us connecting with Godric, or at least that's for me. Godric was just over it. He came into the show, he said, what's this called, True Blood? Bitch, I'm done. So he came in, he already signed a contract to die. Um, but his three episodes or so, um, that's it with Godric? I feel like it was such a build up of Godric and then we just ended it. I'm kind of shocked, no shade. Um, but regardless, moving right along, he blew up in blue, fa blue flame. And I thought that somewhere, I thought I heard him say that he like is a day walker because he's so old. Or is it that he doesn't need blood anymore? Am I just dreaming shit and going with that? I don't know, y'all. Um, Suki, Suki. She did not bother me this episode. I actually really did enjoy her. I cried when her and Jane, uh, didn't seem not James, Jason spoke about their grandmother. I started crying. I felt very emotional because I thought about my own grandmother. Oh, I loved her all the way down. Um, and I miss her every single day. So that whole incident. And then when they were saying that they, it's only them, Jason and Suki, I felt that. You know, I really did feel that because a lot of my family that um, I was super close with 
when the pandemic happened, my whole world turned upside down. I'm such a narcissist. I always end up talking about myself. We're talking about vampires. Regardless, give me a, mo give me a moment to uh, get emotional. Um, but, you know, the pandemic happens. I, a lot of people that I grew up with and family-wise that were like the pillars of our family, they died. Um, either due to the pandemic or everything, they just, every everything just happened at that time. That was the worst year of my whole entire life. Um, and then moving forward, just more people just passed away. And I'm, you know, now I have my mom pretty much and my siblings. Um, but it's just it's super sad so i felt that scene that scene was giving guys it was giving um but suki did not bother me and suki does that suki's that character where it's when she pisses me off you guys are gonna hear it i'm, I'm gonna keep it 100 i'm going to go ape shit. but they're all the other episodes that she is in that she does not bother me, and I actually really do enjoy her. Minus her picnic outfit that she decided to wear. Honey, she took my picnic blanket and was like, you know what, I'm making this a dress with these white shoes. It was actually kind of a cute outfit. Minus the, those color patterns. Listen, I'm gay, give me a second too. Uh, I gotta be emotional, and now I gotta be <laughs> gay as hell. Um, But that picnic outfit, honey. But she looked cute though, no shade. She was giving a ponytail, she was giving the tears, and she was giving storyline. She was giving this episode. Now, Bill, he irritated me. And believe it or not, Bill normally doesn't irritate me. Uh, Bill, on a rewatch, irritates me. When I'm editing it, he then irritates me because I'm like, oh my God, why is he so annoying? And in this episode, there were so many incidents where he was just like super obsessed with Suki. I think any, any relationship where two people are super obsessed with each other is beyond toxic. I'm gonna need you to step out to, uh, 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 he needs to do something. He really needs to do, like, they both need to take a look. Yes, I know they're married in real life. I don't know how they, I don't know how they act in real life with each other. I hope it's nothing like this show. I hope they give each other a couple of curses here and there. They are so irritating in this show together. I hate seeing <laughs> Misery Loves Company whatever uh, I'm like I'm single screw it uh, but anyways yeah so Bill kind of irritated me and I was like and I also don't think Bill's attractive but then we got to see Eric and his little bum bum so I really am attracted to Eric um, when he was laying there I was like Eric I didn't need to drink your blood for me to be obsessed with you like hello do you want me to get naked right now screw the YouTube channel Let's do it. Um, like I think Eric is so hot. I think he's so hot. I would I would turn to be a vampire. Whatever. What I, I gotta live forever? Okay. As long as I'm with Eric. Like that's how weird it's getting. Um Godric, somebody said Godric was super hot. I was like, eh, I don't see it, but he's cute. I would make out with Godric. His lips are as big as mine. I got those lips that if you throw me into the ocean, honey, I float. Um, I got some ins life insurance just on my lips. Godric has those lips too. Godric definitely has like kissable lips. He looks like he's fun to go riding on a horse with. <laughs> Somebody's like, riding a horse? Huh. Okay. Um, <laughs> but yeah, Godric is like, he's okay. But Eric is, Eric is everything. Um, Jason's storyline I liked. Tara's storyline, I'm kind of over it. Um, I want Tara to go back to being Tara. I'm over, like, like she's an abusive room. I, I know that her mind is being warped by this witch, who, by the way, I live for. Um, but I'm just over, like, the side of Tara. And then seeing her mom come to the rescue was touching. Seeing Lafayette give Lafayette, you guys know he's my favorite character. So Lafayette coming to save his cousin was amazing. And then, once again, beating up that guy, that guy talking mad shit. By the way, although I know the guy who plays uh, Lafayette was not gay, rest in peace, you're still amazing. Um, people always think us gay men, the straight men, not all straight men, but there are straight men out there that believe that gay men can't fight. Let me let you know something. The way Lafayette was giving bam, bam, thank you, ma'am. Honey, I shrunk the kids. Let me let you all know something. If I can't fist fight, and I don't fight no more because I'm in my 30s, but back in the day, if I can't fist fight you, I'm gonna spray mace in your eyes. Like, I'm going to hit you with a chair. I'm going to get a blender and blend you. Like, I am a dirty fighter. And a lot of gays do know how to fight. So seeing Lafayette not be that stereotypical gay guy like what they had in Will and Grace, although it was a really good show, or these other like gay movies and stuff like that where there's the femme gay, there's femme gay guys out there, and like that's all you really see. 
see, where Lafayette gives you kind of like um, femme butch queen, but like I'll throw down like what you want to do. And I like that. I like seeing that, the, you know, the, the, the gay world, it's such a big world. Like for instance, me, I can give you a little femme, but nine out of 10 every day, like uh, what you want to do. That's my, uh, uh, clearly, let's just make the, the channel called what you want to do because that's that's my motto. Um, uh, you want to jump, then let's get froggy. Um, like, I'm, I'm about it. So, <laughs> people are like, who am I subscribed to? This is ghetto. Um, but like, I'm just saying. So anyways, I really do like that whole thing, how they make Lafayette be femme, but also give you that masculine energy, and he does what he does. The witch is amazing. The cop, the cop did, the old cop didn't even bother me. He didn't have much screen time. Um, and then Sam turning to a fly, it's me seeing Sam get out of this, just the dog world, and I know people are like, no, he turns into other things. But because I didn't see it, I was like, yeah, child, I don't believe it. Um, but now that I see him like doing his one to the two, to the two, to the threes, I'm like loving it. I'm loving, 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 loving it. Um, did I hit all the points in this episode? What would I rate this episode? A 10. Absolutely. This, oh, is that lady on TV the strongest vampire, or one of the strongest vampires, or is she just like the head honcho along with the team and whoever the hierarchy of the vampires is because she's on TV and publicity kind of thing, where she, that's, she's just more, she's not powerful of her age or in her strength, but she's powerful because of what position she is. Is that what she is? And the magistrate. Is it that guy that we saw that one time on top of that car and I think season one? Does he oversee all the sheriffs? Is that what it is? I need to know like, the, 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 the hierarchy of the vampires in this show. Um, regardless, we have how many more episodes? Holy guys, we still got three episodes. I don't know where we're gonna go from here. Like, what the hell? This is a very long season and I just feel like every episode now seems like we're on the next episode is gonna be the finale. And then I look here and I see we got three more. So it's hitting, it's hitting, it's hitting. I love it, I love it, I love it. Thank you guys so much for being here. Check out all my other reactions. And until next time, I'm off this.